This is a cyborg. And in the game, Blox Rich is known to have one of the best race awakening, which is good for us. Because in this video, we're going to be obtaining the cyborg race. Not only that, evolved from V1 to V4 in one video. All right, so in order to obtain cyborg, you need to do a cyborg puzzle. And the first step is obtaining a fist of darkness. Luckily for me, I've been AFKing in this private server for five hours, so I should get it from the first chest I go to. I hope so. Come on, please prove me right. And fist of darkness. Bro. All right, all right, all right. This one's got to give me the fist of darkness. Ah, oh, we got it. You found a strange item in the chest? Yes, sir. I knew I knew one of them had to be it, bro. All right, so next, you then click on the button used to start an order to insert the fist of darkness into the machine. Then purchase a microchip from the arithmet Arith... 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 English arithmetic NPC in order to begin the raid. Damn, that took me a long time. All right, let me go ahead and go over here. Let me switch to portal. Let me go to hot and cold raid. There we go. Yep. All right, fist of darkness. I just realized something. This is the wrong raid. Okay, so I think the raid is in here. I'm a little bit slow today to start, guys. Just give me, give me, give me, give me a chance. Then you click on that. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay, your fist of darkness has been processed. Please supply a core brain to continue. Oh, okay, so this is the next step. Core brain can be obtained as a drop from order with a 2.5 percent. Wait, 2.5? So you mean to tell me we might have to fight law several times in order to get this core brain? Yeah. So if I'm going to be fighting law, I need to have uh, Buddha for this because I don't see this working no other way, bro. All right. Yeah. Let me equip Buddha. All right. So it said I needed to buy a chip from the arithmetic NPC. I believe that brother is over here. Right up here. Yes, sir. Okay. Let me see here to make a bargain. I see you make yourself at home. I want to buy a microchip for 1000. Just so you know, this will turn out much better for me than it will for you. No refunds. I beg your pardon. Bro, why does it sound like a formula to get scammed? All right. Let me trade 1000 for microchip. I have 1500 more fragments so if we don't get it first try we only have one more run unless of course i spend robux now we just stand in this blue thingy press press that and we got law and order yes sir okay so i'm gonna go buddha we just gonna go to town on this boy mm -hmm. yes sir yes sir now if i remember correctly according to the wiki this dude has like 256,000 health ah there he goes there he goes see this is why i hate fighting law bro he just he, he he's just always teleporting around like bro you're not the flash bro like i don't know oh my god oh my Damn, he dissected me. I'm about to dislocate this guy's head if he don't stop running around me, bro. Like, what is what is this, bro? Can you fight me, bro? I'm gonna get him with this. I'm gonna get him with this. Boom. Bro, how did that not hit? All right, he almost dead. We're making progress. We're making progress. Stop bullying me. You know, it'd be crazy if I got this first chance. Damn, I really thought I was about to get that first try. I thought I was him there for a second. You're not that guy. All good, though, because I can buy another chip for my boy Arithmetic. Yes, sir. He gonna hook me up this time for sure. All right, round two. Let's run it. Oh, my God. This boy's about to make me rage. This boy is... And we still didn't get it the second time. All right, now we got to cash in Robux. Buy Robux. I'm gonna start off with the 999 package. Hopefully, we won't need more than that. Payment success. This one will be the one. This one will be the one, I believe. Come on, Law. Come on. Come on. I got Coco and Zebra Cab. When will I get the core? brain bro will i ever get it should i give up no nah man we ain't giving up bro we don't we gonna get this core brain next time bro trust cap hey yo what you just say <laughs> play my doom music yeah we're about to beat that boy up it's done you ain't about to say that about my rng and get away with it bro that's why i'm about to get it this run bro i'm about to get it this run Pack him up. Pack him up. Ooh, I'm hitting with them combos. You ain't ready for this. You ain't ready for this, man. You ain't ready for this. Yo, yo, that boy ain't talking now, is he? I'm about to prove to you I got dub RNG right. <laughs> but I had my power up, bro. I, I had my theme song. What, what, what happened? Bro, how is that man talking to me from the grave? I don't know what type of edit I just did there. <laughs> nah, but this gotta be the run that I get the core brain. Otherwise, I ain't gonna cap. I'm finna leave a very biased comment on Gamer Robot's channel. Come on. <sighs> Gamer Robot. <laughs> nah, I ain't gonna send that. I ain't gonna send that. Can you drop it, please, Law? This is this is this is getting very old, very quick. If you'll just jump into my sword one more time, bro. I knew it was fake. Come on, bro. Five percent ain't even that high, bro. Five percent. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. Let me calm down. It's like five. It's like six a.m. Hold on. Everyone's about to be asleep. Core braid. Oh my god. Oh my. Yo, this is this is this is taking too long. But I believe now we go up here, go down to the the Law raid thing again, hold out the chip, and then press this thing i guess we just press it your core brain has been processed please head downstairs uh i think we need like 2500 fragments in order to buy the cyborg race we have 3109 so we chill in click to interact would you like to change your race to cyborg 2500 this race is specialized in defense and energy okay boom let's accept 
Race change to Cyborg. Hey, you know what I'm saying? I look like Cyborg from Teen Titans. Built like that, man, for real. Okay, so we've gotten the first major step out the way. We've gotten the race Cyborg. Next step down is getting to race V2. So, uh, you know what I'm saying? Let me go to Doc 3 right quick. Boom. Hello. It appears you haven't unlocked your maximum potential yet. Blah, 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 blah. He's going to make us pay 500,000. Oh, wait. We need to find the fire flowers first. Okay, so since it's daytime, red flowers can spawn. Blue flowers only spawn during nighttime. So, yeah, we can't find any blue flowers right now currently but red flowers do spawn we go to the cafe i think i saw a red flower somewhere over here earlier oh yep right here it's still here okay cool 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 one flower down to get a yellow flower you literally just have to kill an npc so let's do that let's see if the first time's the charm boys okay okay first time is not the charm the moment I stop recording, I end up getting a yellow flower. That's actually crazy. Okay, so we've got the both the red and yellow flower. Now we need to wait till it's nighttime because that is the only time the blue flower spawn. Later. I just want to rock. Buddy, yada, yada. All right, I bet it's nighttime so we can go searching. Let me go first island, remote island. Usually the blue flower tends to be on. Okay, never mind. It's not on here. And it is also not here. Ah, but there it is right there. Okay, we got all three flowers. We got red, we got yellow, and blue. Let's get our race V2. All right, Alchemist. I believe this is where he's going to charge us 500k. Damn! Low-key highway robbery. Thanks, I've enhanced your body. Your defense against melee, sword, and gun attacks have been increased by 10%. Additionally, 15% of received damage will become to energy oh, okay that's actually kind of dope you know what i'm saying we kind of speed run through these things now but maybe v3 will be kind of hard oh wow the cyborg v3 quest is actually the easiest of them all bro give any physical fruit to ariel this includes fruits from the treasure storage difficulty one out of five literally the lowest difficulty <laughs> all right though say less i'm cool with that all right arrow let me go talk to you right quick greetings excellent talk to me again once you have a fruit in your inventory <laughs> let's hit him with a disrespect let's give him a kilo will he take this though he's yeah. actually gonna take the he actually took the kilo. Oh my God. And I get to keep the kilo. Okay, but I've literally no idea what energy core does. Let's go ahead and activate that energy core. Ah, uh, okay. So it activates a little energy around me. Just damage anyone. Damn, that actually does dummy damage. 5,255? Sheesh. So like I could just activate that while doing a combo and it'll just increase my combo by 5,000. That's that's actually crazy, bro. Okay, getting V2 and V3 was the easy part, but I'm not gonna lie. Getting V4 for this might be where the hard part comes in. Full moon imminent. The light of a full moon peeks through the clouds. All right, we're ready. So we gotta go over to Great Tree. I got my three boys here in the private server with me. They're gonna help me get to V4. All right, we're at the top of Great great tree now i need to go over here go to mysterious force okay so we're at the temple of time go all the way over here take a left pull the lever of course this is my first time doing a race before awakening but this is my first time doing cyborg so i do not know what a cyborg all right so i believe this is the cyborg room they want me to do the countdown so three two one go all right let's do it trial starting in five four three two and one all right there we go there we go so i do not know what the cyborg trial is oh wait survive until the end watch out for bombs okay okay oh that should be easy this should be easy okay okay so we just have to avoid the bombs for 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 how long until the end of this time let me not get complacent let me not get complacent we just keep dodging the bombs player completed the trial so when does this end bro do i have to go until the end I'm dodging them i'm dodging them this is this is relatively easy i'm not gonna lie not very difficult oh that's it that's it there can only be one luckily i think these boys are about to reset for me so i don't i don't i don't have to actually fight these boys all right reset andre reset and the spirit has answered okay so now i just gotta follow this thing right here okay 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 we're about to get race v4 go up the stairs of time and i'm excited for this bro i've never had cyborg before so I'm, I'm curious to see how this will work okay interact with the cog all right choose a gear to replace well we can only do one okay boom and we've done it we've unlocked gear four Ooh. i mean v4 come back when you complete the trials again oh wait a minute oh i got wings now let me see if i can talk to the ancient one come back when you trained more okay so now in order to do the next trial i need to train and in order to train you need to just awaken your v4 all right all right so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna damage my boy andro my bar down there goes up there we go okay okay awakening yes sir Ooh, this thing look clean Bro, look at that pose. I wonder what the cyborg V4 ability actually does, though. How many times I got to train, though? I don't know. But well, that was helpful. I don't give a f what you think, bitch. Second awakening. My boy Rip Guy said I need to train for three minutes. Okay, so what, like three transformations or something? We'll just do three and then check in. Uh. 
third transformation yes sir all right let's go check if i've done enough training okay bot transformation upgrade for 1000 here you go that should fit into the clock okay so i think we're ready to do it now three two one go all right let's get it wait what happened wait why didn't it work did you buy it winter yes ah bro the full moon ended bro let me talk to the ancient one just to make sure you're ready for the next trial. See, that's what I thought, bro. Like, why didn't it work? All right, no biggie. We just got to find another full moon. Yes, sir. A lot of full moon peaks through the clouds. We ready. All right, we here. Now we have to wait for Rip Guy. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's not up here, I don't think. Now, I genuinely have no idea what the other two gears for uh, Cyborg V4 does. So I'm actually curious to find out how much of an upgrade this was. Three, two, one, go. And it still did not work. Bro, what is going on? Ah, uh, okay. Trial starting in three, two, one. I don't know why it didn't work before. It was weird, but uh, okay. Survive to the end. Watch out for the bombs. This one's very easy. I don't see myself losing to this at all, bro. <laughs> Damn, someone already completed the trial? Sheesh. How do you do that so quick? Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Damn, this looks like twice as many bombs as the first time. Wait, 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 wait. Yo, yo. Oh, wait. Damn, yo, damn, yo, damn. Wait, wait. What are these boys doing? What? All right, all right, let's go up here. Next cog, let me go right here. All right, so we have two gears we can choose. First one, Aftershock. Attacks now apply an electrifying effect that disables the opponent's instinct ability temporarily. Damn, that's OP. I could just make them not be able to use Observer's Naki. Mm -hmm. All right, what's number two? Energy control, damage dealt now chains to nearby enemies through orbs. Allows the user to super jump. Must have instinct enabled. Sensational. Let's get that one first, baby. Let's get that one. Come back when you complete trials again. All right, say less. So now we get some like super jump thing. Let's go test that thing out. All right, we got our awakening. All right, let's see what this thing does. Let's see what this thing does. Okay, so I got this little orb thing floating around me right now. How to do super jump. Hold space. Ooh, my God. That's OP, bro. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yo, you get mobility. Nah, that's heat. That's heat, bro. I like that. I like that. Damn, the full moon ends? The moon ain't even set yet. What you mean? <laughs> All right, but I did my third transformation. Let's go see if we still need more training. You've come a long way. As promised, upgrade your transformation limit for 1500. Okay, we have that just barely. Excellent. Okay, so now I guess I can go do the trial again. All right, we gotta go find another full moon. All right, yes, sir, full moon. Let's do it. Okay, okay, okay. You just gotta defeat a sea beast. You ready, Alex? Three, two, one, go. Let's get it. All right, say less, say less. I died. Bro, my trial is easy. All I gotta do is just avoid these bombs. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, I got that. I made it. I made it. I made it. All right. Oh, damn. You said already. I'm finna beat your ass. Oh, whoa, 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 now. Alright, winner. It's time to die. Oh, my ligaments. Yo, what is wrong with this guy? <laughs> Winter clouds beat Sage with the easy cope. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the aftershock this time. Attacks now apply an electrifying effect that disables the opponent's instinct ability temporarily. Come back when you've trained more. I need to go through three additional training sessions. What does that mean again? I gotta transform three more times or what? Transformation number one. Wait, what do I get with this? He ain't gonna be able to use instinct. Wait, wait, I got a damage over time with my hits now? Ooh, kill him! Yo, okay, okay, so that actually makes sense. So whenever I hit people, I get a damage over time that, that, that just stops them from being able to use instinct. That, that's fire. All right, boys, so I'm gonna do one more trial run since we've already unlocked both of the abilities just to get an upgrade with one of the abilities. But we need to do a lot more transformations first. All right, so I've done a lot more awakenings and now he's saying you're ready for the next upgrade. This will cost you 2,500 fragments. Buy that. Say you're ready for the next trial. Say less. Next moon is a full moon, so we're pretty much ready. Oh, oh, oh we got it, we got it, we got it. All right, say less, say less, say less. Yo, packing them up. Got him just in case. Yeah, I don't know why. He's just, he's not resetted. <laughs> All right, nice. I did it. GG's. Final move. Just going to be an upgrade. And I'm going to do the super jump. Yes, sir. All right, final awakening. Yes, sir. Okay, so with the new upgrade is uh, super jump, I don't think I need to have Ken on to be able to do the jump. Now I can just do it whenever. So there we go, boys. We fully awakened and mastered out Cyborg V4. Man, this thing lit, bro. I got the super jump, which has high mobility. And I got this thing right here, which literally just damages anyone in the area so I can just deal with 2v1s. Nah, that's lit. That's lit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it for this video. Comment down below which race you want me to awaken next, and I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.